It may seem self-evident, but if one imagines the time before Mahler composed the first symphony, it did not exist. If he had not written the first symphony, we would not have the resurrection or any of the other symphonies. What miraculous alchemy occurred for these to come into being? I think with all the continual destruction around us and the ongoing threat of planetary disaster and financial and social upheaval, we do not think often enough of the amazing phenomenon of creation. In Mahler's first symphony, we celebrate this mysterious and ever-recurring marvel of what humanity, an integral part of nature, can do. Mahler considered himself the singer of nature, and with this work, he is beginning a symphonic, artistic, and personal journey, which will only end in his death. That journey is now for us to continue. This opens inner doors to all aspiring artists of whatever profession, to what can be done to create something unique and eternal. A person must find his or her own, own voice. Perhaps this first symphony of Mahler will help you find yours give you the courage to listen inwards, not only with regard to the arts, but life itself, to find your own voice and way of life. The greatest art is the art of living, Mahler's thought as well, I believe. Let us, with this short, brilliant and tantalizing film on Mahler's first symphony, reach out to people everywhere, without boundary of continent, language or culture, to persons who do not yet know Mahler that they may begin the journey of the symphonies and their own inner journey. Let us make as many persons as possible dream and let us stimulate each personal vision of life.